QuickBooks uh, is a basically accounting software that helps to manage your accounts and uh, in, it, it helps you to generate invoicings. Uh, it helps to manage expenses and it, it also helps to helps you to generate reports as well. So uh, what we have seen that uh, many customers are using QuickBooks to generate uh, invoicing basically. So what they need to do, they just have to create account in on a Quick, QuickBooks and they have to add their products and uh, customers on the QuickBooks and based on that, uh, they can generate uh, invoicing. Okay, so uh, what we have discovered is that we can uh, take instead of going separate instead of asking customer to go separately on QuickBook and generate quick uh, invoices we can ask customers to generate their invoices on Kailas itself okay so let me show you how we can do this so in order to install the QuickBook uh, marketplace applications you first need to sign in in a Kailas web applications. I have already uh, signed in, so I will just quickly click on the sign in button. And this is the home page of the Kailas. In order to install this QuickBook Marketplace application, you have to go to uh, Kailas Marketplace first. And you can see there is a QuickBook invoicing application. Just click on it. As of now, I have already installed this application, so it will ask me to uh, directly to open the application. But if you are a first time user, you just uh, install this application. It will ask you to enter your credentials. If this is your first time, then please uh, click on a sign up here, fill your information, email ID, name and password and you will ask uh, you will ask to verify your email email id okay once you verify your email id then you can you are ready to sign in into this application once you sign in in the application uh, it will ask you to enter your api key right so uh, how would you find this api key just go to your kaila sales application Go to setting. And there is an API key tab module. And there's a mask on it. You can, uh, you just have to copy this API key and paste it over here. Save this uh, API key and that's it. You are ready to use your QuickBooks application. Now go to connected accounts. Uh, click on the connected account. <coughs> Connect your QuickBooks. It will ask you to log in into uh, QuickBooks account. Uh, I have already, uh, I already have a one QuickBook account, so I will just quickly sign in into my uh, into the QuickBooks with my Gmail account. It's a two factor verification, so I need to enter password of the QuickBooks. This is the uh, company that I have created in the QuickBook accounts. Uh, if you have a company already created in the Quick QuickBook, then you can you you will see the connect created company name over here i will simply connect my quickbook account with the kailas one Just a minute. It's 
to quickly recap the things what we have done till now so uh, first i have uh, logged in into the kailas web application then in order to uh, install the quickbook application i will just go to marketplace application and uh, there is a quickbook invoicing applic marketplace application i will just simply open it i have already installed it but you can uh, if you if this is your first time then just install this application after installing please sign up uh, verify your email id and you are ready to sign in once you sign in Uh, you will see this window just uh, copy your uh, kailas web application api key into this placeholder and save it you will find this api key in kailas sales setting and api key module just copy this api key and paste it over here and yes you are ready to connect your quickbooks account just go to connected accounts as i have already connected you will see there is a connect your quickbooks account cta just click on this account uh, enter your quickbooks credentials and just you are ready to use quickbooks in kailas itself you will see there is a invoices customers and disconnect option <coughs> you don't need to do anything just go to kailas go to deals just excuse me for a minute so in order to generate the invoicing just go to deals you will see lots of deals i have created select one particular deal for which you want to create a invoice okay you can see there is estimated value and actual value just go to more uh, actions cta as i have already installed the application i can see they generate quickbooks invoice cta this is typical a marketplace application this will be available only if you have installed the marketplace application and uh, you have already connected your quickbooks account with the kailas one just click on the generate quickbooks invoices you will see this form okay i can select customers if i have uh, already added in the uh, quickbooks or i can just simply add a new customer i will see let a company for which i want to get this invoice i have not uh, configured my gst so i will simply uh, select non registered for gst registration type enter my company customer name Yes, you just need to fill out all the information which is asking. This is your QuickBooks customer. Uh, in order to fetch this uh, customer in Kailas, you need to first create this customer in the uh, QuickBooks itself. So I have already created two customers. so i will select one customer from here and we'll simply add this customer okay so this customer is has you can see that there is a successful message that customer added successfully it automatically fetch the uh, uh, email id of the contact i will select products and services that for which i want to create this invoice uh it asked me to uh, select the product id from the quickbooks so let's uh, enter some description 50 and amount uh 
you can see the uh, amount has already been selected by uh, actual uh, uh, estimated closure value okay if the if there is already uh, I have already added a actual closure value then it will fetch actual closure value in absence of the actual closure value it will directly take um, directly fetch estimated closure value and that's it i will select the gst type and just okay save it and that's done uh, if you want to sync this invoice with your QuickBooks account, just click on the sync with QuickBooks CTA. And that's it. This invoice will be uh, auto sync with uh, manually sync with QuickBooks, your QuickBooks account. Now you can download this invoice in the PDF format or you can directly email to selected context email ID and that's it. This invoice, you can, you can see the successful message that invoice has sent successfully. Okay. So this was all about uh, QuickBooks. Uh, let me recap all the things again. So first uh, install the QuickBooks application. Uh, go to Kailas Marketplace app, select QuickBooks invoicing and install this application. Once you install your application, enter your uh, credential, uh, enter your credentials and sign up, sign in into the application, QuickBooks invoicing applications. Once it is signed in, then connect your QuickBook account. I've already, I had already connected, so it, it is not asking me to again enter my credentials. So I will simply connect. And that's it. You, you don't need to do anything extra in order to create invoicing in directly from uh, Kailas to QuickBooks. Your account is connected and now you can you are ready to create invoices of your all the deals in Kailas itself. Once you create invoices, just Okay, where did I connect it? Once you have created account, uh, created invoice, then you can simply download uh, and email the uh, same as I sh had shown on the previous steps. So this was all about the QuickBooks. Uh, So any questions for this? Thank you. Thank you very much for attending this webinar. Thanks a lot.